Hey guys, welcome back to Age of Empires 2 Definitive Edition. Now we're going to start Joan of Arc. In the old game and the um, HD edition, they had like a 1 and stuff, so they tell you like which is the order of these campaigns, but it looks like um, you can do them, they got rid of it. No, um. February 19th. Army camp near vos couleurs. This morning I awoke to visions of fire and steel. These nightmares come more often now that I've seen my beloved France eaten away by years of war. I wandered through camp, ignoring the new snowfall, but observing the wounds and weariness of every soldier under my command. Observing the desperation in their eyes. It was then that I first saw the girl. She told us that her name was Joan. She told us she was but a peasant who did not know how to ride or fight. She told us that she intended to rescue France. The darkness lifted from the men's souls. Ooh. Her voice rang with conviction, and we drank in her every word. I may have lost my faith, but Joan has not lost hers, and that is enough for me. Joan has asked our ragged band of soldiers to take her to Chinon, where the rightful ruler of France, the Dauphin, hides from his foes. The war-torn land in between is infested with enemy marauders, and we will lose many men. Death is by now an old companion, but for Joan, we will face it again. Hmm, seems like they got, seems like every place that these campaigns are set in, they got someone from that country, which is good. Come on. Drone must survive. Oh, they can die, still die in this. That's stupid. Bonjour, Joan. My colleague and I will escort you to the Chateau of the Dauphin, or else we will die trying. I am Jean de Metz, and I will protect you with my life. Ah, oh, looks like... Prêt. Huh. Hmm. Café? Pirates? Certes? Maybe we've got to go all the way to there. You are Joan of Arc! I have heard your claims oh, yeah. and believe what you say. We will follow you to Chinon. Men at arms. Wait! You might have need of a few archers on the road ahead. You must be wary on the road ahead. Our enemies, the English, are out in force, and their Burgundian allies are thick as rats. Discretion is the better part of valor. Hopefully I can... There. Oh, we have to go that way. We have to go down here. You got to stay here once they all die. The English right off. Loss for France. I hope you really can turn the tide of this war, Joan of Arc. They just disappear along here. Leave it. 
Yeah, you thought it was easy, but look, the bridge is out. So now you gotta go along here. Oh yeah. Sir. The bridge is out. The English must have destroyed it. We must find another way oh, to yeah. Shino. Highwaymen playing on helpless travelers? What has become of our homeland? Oh yeah. You gotta go this way because you go too close, they will Yeah. I'll just go this way. Leave it. And kill those wolves. Bonjour. À la bataille. Faut huh. Oh yeah. Like that wolf got scared. Okay, here to get um, some salt, more soldiers. Leave it. Oh, yeah. Bonjour. Da. Assault. Oh yeah. Yeah, don't bother going over there. You won't last. Gather your belongings, men. We follow Joan of Arc. We will carry that ram along with us. It may yet be of use. It is because Oh yeah. Um just get through here. Sept. Oh yeah. Hopefully um it still works. Like it's it'll still complete it for me. I only use the Marco Polo code, and that doesn't really affect any. Well, it shouldn't affect anything. Bonjour. We need a manganel or ram to get through these walls. You French don't know when to give up. Leave it. So those two you can't be bothered to fight us. Yeah, once you get over here, you have to rush to the, um, uh, into the, there's a drop ship that come, that appears. You gotta, like, get Joan and these two in there first, and then get the other, as much as the other men in there as well. Soldiers everywhere. 
Hurry west to the river where we can make our escape. Seven. Okay, pirates. I've got as many as I can get in there. Yeah, you gotta. Yeah, you gotta go down here. Oh, there's a ga wall galley. Get over here and get to get these guys here. Uh, we lost some uh, some guys there. Don't bother to fight them; you will lose. Fred, leave it. You mean to lead the French army? Such confidants I have not seen since this war began. Very well. You have six more soldiers. John the Met. That one's got ten, this one's got seven, so they should be able to get in. Oh my god, they can just... Oh my god, I'm dumb. Yay, Highway Men was defeated. Oh, yeah. Here they come! Fire! Leave it. What? Why went... Okay. Leave it. These are oranges. Ah, oh, th this is where we need to go. This one isn't even hard. Oh, me of France, shit on English your allies. Red. Then, okay. For only their allies, but they're set as enemies. Shinon, we have made it. Ah, oh, they want to heal us, but they're not really point. The Chateau of the Dauphin. Set. 
The Dauphin will see you now. Yay! Detective has changed. It's got Joan to Shinon. As Joan's footsteps echoed down the marble hall of the chateau, the fat and whispering dukes did naught but stare. The Dauphin himself seemed afraid as she kissed his feet. My gentle Dauphin, she demanded. Why does England claim what is ours? Why are you not crowned King of France, as is your right? The courtiers began to murmur. The Chamberlain whispered lies into the Dauphin's ear. Oh. But the Dauphin pushed the Chamberlain away and rose to meet Joan's gaze. She stands only to the shoulder of the shortest man. But all of us must look up to speak to her. I know not what silent conversation passed between the Dauphin and his would-be savior. But it was obvious that his majesty was in the same thrall as we. Achievements do not progress this game because two codes were used. Yes, okay, it still completes. Good. March 26th, Chinon. It is one thing for a band of dispirited soldiers to put their trust in a teenage girl. It is entirely another for that girl to be given command of the army of an entire nation. Huh. We were filled with pride when we heard the Dauphin's heralds pronounce Joan the Maid as commander of the army of France. So that she may look like a general, the Dauphin presented Joan with a great war horse and a suit of white armor. Joan instructed me to look for an ancient sword buried beneath the altar of a local church. I was skeptical. But not only did the man unearth a rusted blade, but we found that the sword had belonged to Charlemagne, grandfather of France. I shall not doubt her word again. Still visible on the hilt was the Fleur de Lys. Joan adopted the Fleur de Lys as her symbol and had it blazoned upon her battle standard. Wherever Joan goes, the standard goes also. It goes with us to Orléans. The city of Orléans is one of the finest in France. But it is under siege by our enemies. England and Burgundy is about to fall. This war has dragged on for 100 years, with precious few French victories. The people of Orléans need a savior. They will receive Joan of Arc. Okay. I am the Duke de Lanson, milady. I will proudly ride with you to Orléans. The other two from the first episode are not here. That's Joan. Oui. This is Joan now. City needs help. The English are coming. We have to get there. Bon chance, John. Ah, uh, allies. This Burgundian rebel shall not stop us. Oh, we got a champion. Well. Wow. Ah. 
the army of France. It is yours to command. Uh, to got to deliver these carts as well, so they don't get destroyed. I'm going to leave them here. Um. And yeah. on to Orléans. We need to get supplies past the English. Oh yeah. Oh, reds are my allies. Northern English. Then... What? Why? Why are the gates opening? Maybe they're allies with the light blue team. I have no idea. We don't bother attacking the orange. So I can take them now. It didn't last long. Now let's put them there. Burgundy's pretty small. <laughs> Yay! Erlin. Yeah, they're gone now, because I took over all of it. Jones the maid has come. We are saved. Just stick them over here. Why? Oh my god. Why are they going over that way? What the hell are you two idiots doing? Go in there. And how they're retarded. Pretty sure they go over here. Okay, maybe not. Maybe the town center. There. Hola! Jean Navarre has brought us supplies. Now we can muster the forces we need to raise one of the English cases. Okay, uh, you know how with the photon code with the laser troopers? This one, how do you turn this on? Bugatti. They're really fast and really strong.
I only have three because this code's a long one to type in. Oh my god, fucking idiots. See how quickly it kills them. Oh, destroy all the other teams now. Yeah, that's the one we have to destroy. Yeah, when they walk walk into the rain of fire, they get killed instantly. It's annoying, the castles take ages to take out. There's no code to disable the anti-cheat thing yet. Um, when I do it, I'll redo all these and just so I can complete them. What, there's eight? I'm pretty sure I did ten. Oh, yeah. They got destroyed. Uh, so all of them can fire at it. What's that gonna do? <laughs> they re remade the cars, so that's cool. Can it be that the French have finally learned to fight? Whoa! Okay, so you must have to destroy either castle. Huh. Joan prophesied that she would be wounded at Orléans. 
the height of the battle, an Abelest bolt knocked her from her horse. We could not believe our misfortune. But as we carried Joan away from the carnage, the battle was won. Orleans was free. When we entered the city, the entire population cheered us on from windows, rooftops, and city streets. They fired artillery into the night sky and shouted aloud their nickname for Joan. La Pucelle! The Maid of Orleans. Yay! I don't care that that happens. Okay, guys, next part we will start the cleansing of the Leo or Leo. I don't know how to. No, I don't know French words. I'll see you in part two. Bye.